Hey friends, a warm welcome to this channel. In today's video, I'm going to guide you step by step on how you can make an amazing kids storybook and also show the process of publishing it on Amazon KDP. The most exciting part is, you don't need to stress at all about copyright problems. Normally, creating children's books takes a lot of time since you first need to come up with or generate a story then design illustrations for each page using different AI tools. And after that, edit everything carefully inside Canva. This makes the entire journey really time consuming. So in this tutorial, I'll be introducing you to a wonderful tool known as Read Kids. The rights of every storybook you build with this platform stay with you as the official creator, meaning you hold complete ownership. That way, there's no copyright issue to worry about, and you can freely publish your work on Amazon KDP, or even list it on Etsy to start earning passive income. This smart tool takes care of everything for you, writing personalized stories, generating illustrations, and even building consistent characters across pages. So don't wait, head over to the link in the description, click on it, and you'll arrive at the sign-up page. Register with your Gmail account to instantly receive 1,500 points, and by logging in daily, you will receive free points. After registering, head over to this site's homepage. Inside the picture book area, you'll spot two options, Use My Story or AI Generate. Pick whichever works. I'm selecting AI Generate. I am making one single book. If you're planning to publish a full series of books, then select the other option. Now you're inside their complete dashboard where every task can be done in one place. Write a story, pick illustration style, create character art, and modify story. First, let's build our story. As an example, let's create for kids aged four to six years. From here, pick your type of story. Any theme is selectable. I'm leaving it in third-person perspective and non-anthropomorphic. It's your choice, you can alter that if preferred. For size, stick to one-to-one, -to -one, since that's a common format and will later make things easier when preparing the book for Amazon KDP. Now, type a short description. I'm writing, a young pirate sets sail with his crew, discovers a mysterious island, encounters strange creatures, and eventually uncovers hidden treasure. Now just click on AI Generate. And in moments, the story is made. Next, press Extract Roles. Then move to the next step and select a drawing style. There are 208 styles in total. I'll use this one. Now, create the character image. On the left, you'll notice our captain, Lark. She's the main hero of our story. Hit Generate. In a moment, the image appears. You may select any you like, but I'm altering the art style. Let's pick this one. Let's generate again. Now there are four versions of the same hero at different angles. I really like this one and will keep it as my character design. Now it's the turn to create the side character, Pip. Pip is a dog.
The dog's art is also finished. Both characters are ready. Click Next. This gives you the storyboard. It includes 13 total pages. Press Next. Here is where you can edit the entire book. The very first page becomes the cover of the storybook. Let's start with that. Click this. Now you get four variations of cover images. Pick whichever appeals. Click Apply to Canvas. Done. Now let's adjust the title text. Select the cover font template for titles. Pick whichever you like. There are many. Enable the bleed lines and avoid placing anything outside them. This helps later when formatting for KDP. Now the cover design is complete. Move on to the following page. Again, click Generate. Select the picture you like. You may add a speech bubble to the page. Adjust it to the text area. Second page done. Let's go ahead. Repeat this process. Generate the image. Insert a bubble. Align it as per the layout. In the same way, repeat the steps across every page. You'll see, I've built all pages. Preview them from here. Once satisfied with your storybook, click here, then export PDF. Congratulations, your book is created. Another feature on this site lets you build a narration video for your book. First, produce the voices right here. Choose from any available narrators. Generate each voiceover here. After finishing, click Generate Video. Select animations, sound effects, or background tracks. Then, press Generate. After it's ready, click here. The Secret Island of Captain Lark Early one sunny morning, young Captain Lark hopped aboard her little wooden ship, the Sea Star, ready for an adventure. The waves whispered, 
swish, as her boat left the friendly harbor. Lark wore her lucky blue scarf. And there you'll find the video. The video is very handy. You can freely promote your storybook on different platforms using this video. Just upload it to Instagram or TikTok. Add your store or Amazon link to your profile bio. This video is highly useful. Or you can embed a QR code inside your book that links to this video. That way buyers can enjoy it as well. It benefits them too. The platform offers four paid plans. Zero, 10, 24, and $50 monthly. Choose whichever suits your needs. My advice, start with standard or pro. Once your books begin selling well, you can upgrade to mega. That gives 50,000 credits, 5,000 bonus credits, and allows even more books to be created. All right, let's check how to prepare it for KDP. Since we built a one ratio one book, we'll design it as an 8.5 by 8.5 inch storybook. This is the same ratio. Go to Canva and open a design with custom size. 8.625 by 8.75 inches. If Amazon KDP is new to you, watch my video on it. You'll see why this size works for an 8.5 by 8.5 inch book. Place all story pages inside one at a time. Leave out the cover. After completion, click Share, Download, File Type, PDF Print. For the cover, go to the site. Enter all details and generate the template. Create a new design with those given sizes. Place the front cover here and resize carefully. Never cross the bleed lines. For the back, pick any image from that platform and add it here. It's your call how creative you want to be. Edit both the back and the front. When done, download with the same settings. That's it. We only need these two files for KDP upload, the inside manuscript and the front cover. The rest of the details you can write yourself. Watch my tutorial if you'd like extra help in uploading on KDP. And that's it. You now know the full process of creating and formatting your own picture book. I hope this guide helps you bring your stories to life and share them with the world. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye.